If you are part of the marketing world, then I'm 100% sure that you must have come across this space called T-shaped marketing. Sounds fancy, isn't it? But in today's world, this space is a pretty big deal. And if you really want to progress further in your marketing career, then you need to really understand what exactly it means. Hey fellas, welcome back to another video. My name is Alan Chikara and I'm a growth marketer by profession, specialized in demand generation and improving closure rates. In today's video, we will be decoding what exactly does T-shaped marketing means and how can you become a T-shaped marketer to progress further in your career. So let's get started. All right, so right now the diagram that you can see in front of your screens, this is the visual representation of a T-shaped marketer because you know, it's the letter T and in letter T you can see on, on the top line, you can see different online marketing channels written and at the bottom line, you can see different sub marketing channels written because right now paid media is in the middle of this uh, letter t so the sub channels under paid media are written such as facebook ads google ads instagram ads and linkedin ads etc so if you're ever going to search t-shaped marketing online nine out of ten times you're going to find a very similar diagram like this which basically is the visual representation of a t-shaped marketer or marketing but the question really is that what exactly is this diagram telling us? What exactly does this T-shape mean and why there are a bunch of online you know, marketing channels written on the top and at the bottom of the uh, uh, bottom line of the letter T, right? That's what exactly this video is all about. So in the most simplest form and in the most simplest definition, which is my own definition, a T-shape marketer or T-shape marketing is nothing but a person who understands all these channels uh, which are present in online marketing right right now you can see almost every online marketing channel is written on the top of the uh, on the top line of letter t right uh, and that's exactly what this is representing that hey if you want to be a t-shaped marketer then you need to have knowledge about all these marketing channels which are written at the uh, at the top line of letter t and then you need to further have you know sub knowledge of different uh, not sub knowledge but you need to further have knowledge of the different sub channels which are part of the main channel for example in paid media you need to have knowledge of facebook ads google ads instagram ads linkedin ads maybe it's social media and you need to have knowledge of you know how does instagram works how does facebook works how does tiktok works and xyz right but the million dollar question is that can one person learn everything that is present in t-shaped marketing i mean just think about it give it a thought i mean these channels are broader and bigger in their own way like content marketing in itself is bigger email marketing in itself is bigger data analytics in itself is a very very wider field paid media you know once again very big search marketing big social media once again big e-commerce marketing man that is just massively bigger than the rest of them right so how does one can become a t-shaped marketer right because in order to progress in your career t-shaped marketing it has become a necessity you need to become an all right all all rounder in order to progress in your career as a marketer or maybe if you're running a business and to scale your business you need to adapt to a t-shaped marketing strategy so don't worry i will exactly decode the actual you know definition of t-shaped marketing because online most of the time, you will find people saying that, hey, a T-shaped marketer is someone who understands uh, all the marketing channels. But there's a catch in this definition, and I'm going to explain exactly what that catch is. So stay tuned, and we're going to answer that in a few seconds. Do you really need to be a master of all the marketing channels to be a T-shaped marketer? I mean, let's think of it from a human perspective. I mean, for me, I don't think so that it is humanly possible for someone to be to call themselves as the master of all the online marketing channels. Why? Let's take an example. For example, you're in your high school and you need, and while you're in high school, you need to study a bunch of subjects, right? You need to study English, maths, uh, chemistry, biology, history, physics, and maybe some other subjects. Can you really say to yourself that, yes, I was the master of all the subjects that I, I used to study in high school? Can you really say that, yeah, I used to get 100 out of 100 in all the subjects and I, you know, it was just a piece of cake for me well until unless you are you are an you know genius born as an exception 
but as a common person or a general or an, or general person i will say it, it is not really possible to uh, call yourself a master of all the subjects yeah maybe you can see that yeah i i, I had a good you know command over english uh, subject or you can say that i was really good with mathematical calculations or you can say that you know i was really good at chemistry but saying you know that you were good at all the subjects i don't think so that works right so why does the t shaped marketer has to understand all the channels you know why does the definition says that you know you need to understand all the channels and why does people get confused that hey do i really need to master all these channels to become a t shaped marketer the answer is no <laughs> don't get confused with with the definition because you need to pay attention to the uh, to the wordings that has been used in the definition the definition of t shaped marketing is not saying that you need to master all the channels it is saying that you need to understand how all these different marketing channels online channels work right there is no mention of the word mastery and that's why if you see a, if you see a person who is a, who's at a you know growth manager level or who is a vp of marketing or vp of growth those people only have mastery of over two to three marketing channels maybe paid ads uh, content marketing seo or some other channels not more than two to three because i don't think so it is humanly possible for someone to you know have a good command over more than three marketing channels so that's why i'm saying it two to three because me myself i i am very good at you know paid ads linkedin outreach and email outreach so those are my channels where which i am really good at and i do have understanding of all the other marketing channels which are there in online marketing but i can't really call themselves myself as a master of those channels or an or a specialist of those channels i can call myself as a specialist of paid ads whether google facebook or any or you know linkedin outreach or email outreach or email marketing in general right so a t shaped marketer is someone who has the mastery or speciality of at least two to three marketing channels but they also have a working knowledge or also have an understanding of how other marketing channels work and the reason why they need to understand how other marketing channels work is very important because that is why they are at vp of marketing or growth marketing positions and you are still stuck at an executive level so we're going to discuss exactly that in few seconds so why does a t shaped marketer needs to understand all the marketing channels out there the main reason behind that is to basically create growth strategies for their business and going a bit deeper basically create a synchronized multi channel strategy for the business growth because in today's world depending upon one marketing channel is no longer possible because it's going to affect your sales in the long run so you need to adapt to a multi marketing channel uh, approach in order to you know grow your business year on year and that's why a t shaped marketer really needs to understand all the marketing channels so that they can create a strategy which in which he or she can at least use two to three or maybe four marketing channels at once and try to create like a multi channel approach so that they can find you know the right channels through which they can generate consistent leads or consistent sales because for a business the one of the most important thing to crack is to keep on generating consistent sales on a monthly basis or a consistent leads on a monthly basis if you are a b2b business uh, and if you are a b2c it is basically sales right d2c sorry that is sales and without you know having this multi channel strategy growing your business and you know making it a success is no longer possible in 21st century guys so that's why in the beginning i said that as a t shaped marketer uh is the need of the hour like a t shaped marketer is the need of the hour a t shaped marketer need, needs to be present in the company for the in order for the company to grow because uh just running google ads just running facebook ads or just running you know linkedin outreach is no longer the option to survive to survive you need to be present in all the marketing channels and that's where the t shaped marketer comes in because these are the people who are on roles such as you know vp of marketing or vp of demand generation or vp of growth or maybe digital marketing manager or jari yari yara these these people are uh, are at a pretty strategic role where their where their responsibility is to actually create a strategy which you know drives success and growth for the business and then the person can hire professionals to ex for different marketing channels to execute that strategy 
you don't really have to do everything by yourself guys honestly you know as a t-shaped marketer if you expect that you need to uh, like strategize brainstorm create a strategy and even execute it by yourself once again that is not humanly possible you need people under yourself to do that and that's why basically anyone who's a t-shaped marketer they are at a you know team leadership roles or ma man managerial roles so pretty much you know if i want to conclude this video with a small thing uh, like like with a small you know summary that is uh, a t-shaped marketer is someone who understands all the marketing channels out there in online marketing but has mastery over two to three marketing channels now that can be whether paid ads uh, seo content marketing whatever you know you have specialization of but you know you are master of three channels or, or specialist of three channels but you also understand how other marketing channels work. You know, you don't have to be very in-depth knowledge, but you just need to understand, you know, what marketing channel uh, is helpful in what scenarios. So that is what a T-shaped marketer is. And basically why T-shaped marketing is the need of the hour is because you, you need to have a multi-channel approach these days in order to grow your business or grow someone else's business. Surviving on one single channel is no longer an option. You need to have multi-channel approach to keep on bringing your, your, yourself leads or sales on a consistent basis. So that's why if you really want to, you know, become a T-shaped marketing, stay, st just, you know, specialize in at least two marketing channels. Maybe right now you might be a paid ad specialist or even in paid ads, you might just only be a Google ad specialist. Go ahead and try to become a specialist of Facebook ads, LinkedIn ads, and then also try to become a specialist in, let's say, maybe SEO or maybe, let's say, in some other or video marketing or something like that. And, you know, once you are, are specialized in two channels, then go ahead and try to understand about other channels. I mean, there's a bunch of information out there on the Internet. You just need to watch some videos just to understand how different channels work. And once you crack that, you technically become a t-shaped marketer because now you are in a position to create like a multi-channel strategies and once you are in a position to create a multi-channel strategies then boom you go your career is gonna go like this so that's it fellas thanks for watching this video if you found it valuable please hit that thumbs up button and press that subscribe button so that you can receive my future videos but for now that's it and see you in the next one